In the U.S., about 17% of the country's total greenhouse gas emissions are emitted from our homes. The most common sources are electricity, heating, and garbage. So today, Shane Madison, Vice President of Energy Conservation Solutions, is visiting my home here in Georgia to undertake an energy audit. The idea is to find areas where energy is being lost. The goal is twofold, save power and reduce the utility bill. The first part of the audit, we're going to, we need to go through and see exactly what you have now. So we're going to check your air conditioning unit, your, um, your insulation, your appliances, we're going to check water drainage around the house, every, every aspect of your house in respect to energy usage. After that, the fun part begins in the sense that we're going to bring our tools. We're going to do a thermal scan of the entire house. Um, and if we, when we find things, we'll tap you on the shoulder and say, come look at this. Um, We'll also do a blower door test where we depressurize the house and that negative pressure then air comes in in all the leaky areas in your house and that's where we really learn a lot. Uh, we also do a duct blaster test. We're going to pressurize your duct system to find out if you have leaky ducts and that's an area of energy lots people don't recognize a lot of times. Uh, from there we're going to test your gas lines for gas leaks. We're going to look at uh, uh, car, all your uh, gas appliances, make sure they're venting carbon monoxide outside of the house. And that's essentially, you know, what the audit entails. So you're looking good here. I've gone through each, each one of these joints. And you can see where they were, they were, they're attached and soldered together. Mm -hmm. And you don't have any leaks. No gas leaks. Now the one thing that I see just right off the top is that your your bats insulation, we don't like bats too much because you know you're working against gravity. So when they lose contact with the subfloor, air goes right in there and you're gonna have air infiltration. There's gonna be leaks and crevices around your floor and floorboards and everywhere. And, and cold air will come up through there, make your home more efficient, your HVAC, you have to work harder. Uh, we're just testing, testing for carbon dioxide output. We need to figure out when the oven's at a steady state so we can see what it's actually putting out into the room. Uh, you don't want to get any more than 30 parts per million. And right now it's it ranges from 8 to 19. So it passes. During the blower door process, we're basically sucking the air out of the house and lowering the pressure, which forces the air from outside in. And lowering the pressure, we can walk around the house and figure out where the leaks are coming in the house. We lower it to negative 50 pascal and hopefully the house will actually get to that point. We're performing a duct blaster test. We're actually testing the efficiency of the duct system and the leakage. So we're adding pressure to the house and trying to match that pressure in the duct system. And if they equalize out with little pressure, then the system is good. It takes more pressure to equalize with the house and the system is leaking. So the, this thermal camera detects temperature, obviously, and you can see this door, you've got no weather stripping on your door to your basement here. And you can see the cold air coming in all around and under because you've got absolutely nothing. Let's see. Keep going down here. You can see all that cold air coming in. That's a real inexpensive and easy way to increase your efficiency. So will you tell me the final results? Yes, after doing all the testing, the blower door and the duct blaster system, you basically have a 0.33 air exchange for your house. So every three hours, your house will exchange with the outside air. And then in the duct blaster system, we found out that the downstairs unit only has a 4% leakage, and the upstairs unit has a 7% leakage. Um, so overall, it's actually a very efficient home. Great. So. <laughs>